Ben has unlocked the secrets of understanding how our minds control our business and daily lives. Inside each episode, Ben shares his proven actionable items, tips, and secrets to managing the supercomputer between your ears so you can build and develop your business and start living the life you desire and deserve. This is Practical Psychology for Business with Benjamin Halpern. Welcome to today's podcast. In life, There are three dimensions available to you to live in. You can live in the past, you can live in the present, and you can live in the future. Now, present, hey, that sounds like something I like. Who doesn't like presents? Yes, the present is a present from God. That's where presents happen. That's where all the good comes into your life when you live in the present. Because all you can deal with, all you can live it, all you can gain The only place where you can receive is in the present, because the past is gone, it's done. The future is not here yet. So if you're living living in past, or you're living in future, you're wasting your time, because nothing real can happen there, okay? Actually, the way I see it is, living in the present, obviously, is the middle of the highway. That's driving, and that's the quickest way to get to your destination, because you're driving down the lanes of the highway. Now, like every highway in the world, you can fly off it. So there's two guardrails. You have a guardrail on the right and a guardrail on the left. Now, the way God, in his infinite wisdom, created the world is he also created the present, where you get presents, where you succeed, where you love life, where you enjoy, where you make progress. And that's down the middle of the road. And your two guardrails are guardrail to one side, stress, worry, anxiety. That is the future. There is a guardrail that tells you You're off lane. You're going into the future. You're driving off the highway. And the emotions that tell you that is worry, fear, anxiety, which are futuristic emotions, right? It's emotions about being worried, concerned, and so on. Then you have the guardrail on the other side, which is telling you you're off course, and that's the past. Living in the past will not get you to go the quickest way where you want to go. You're derailing. And the way you know you hit that guardrail is you feel regret, depression, guilt. Those emotions tell you you're living in the past. So as long as you don't drive straight, it's going to take you a very, very long time to get to to your destination, or you'll never get there because you're totally derailed. So make sure you don't hit the guardrails. And instead of getting a bang and a smash to know you hit the guardrail and your bumper falls off, the way you know you hit the guardrail is emotionally your bumper falls off and you get smashed by feeling negative emotions. So if you're living in worry, stress, anxiety, you hit one side guardrail. If you're living in regret, depression, guilt, you hit the other guardrail. So how do you know you're going straight down the center? Because it feels good. It feels amazing. And you make progress. So this is the challenge in life, how to stay straight. Well, the trick of the game is the emotion of gratitude is the emotion of the present, appreciating, smelling the coffee where you're now. So if you feel gratitude, you're on the path going straight and make sure you don't get derailed and there are tricks in the game how to we talked about in previous episodes how to pump prime the pump for gratitude how to get yourself into that mode how to stay away from worry and fear in the in the future how to stay away from guilt regret and depression from the past and live in the present that's where it happens that's how you make progress this is the challenge we have many of us don't stay in the present because the present forces you to face reality. Reality is you need to work hard to build your relationships. Reality is you need to work hard to build your business. Reality is you need to work hard to have a healthy body. It's very easy to steer off the road and go into the future and say, I'll do it tomorrow. I can kill my 86,400 seconds today because tomorrow I'll do something next week. That's making you not stick with the pain of reality. See, God has infinite wisdom made that when you're in reality, when you're living in the moment and you waste it, you're going to feel bad, which is a good mechanism. You should feel bad if you're wasting the present because that's your present and you're throwing it down the toilet. So if you do that, you should feel bad. But when we feel bad, what we wind up doing is we we run out of the present. We ditch out of the present. We go to the future and that makes us not feel the pain in the moment. So we go to the future, we say, okay, next week, two weeks. Or we self-pity, we go into the past and we feel bad about the past 
And all we're doing is draining the present. It might feel good in the moment, but if we feel good in the moment, we're derailed, and we don't feel now that we need to move forward, and we feel comfortable either in self-pity or in worry, and we don't forge ahead. Too many people fall for that. Remember, live in the present. Now, if you don't like the way it feels in the present because you don't like where your way is, where you're right now in the process because you're not moving forward, stick with it. Learn how to deal with that pain. Gratitude is a great way to fill up the present with good emotion. And everybody has what to be grateful for. But if you're having a hard time sticking with the present and find yourself getting derailed, use gratitude to ground you. There are other grounding exercises you could do that we're going to cover. But if you want to just get on it right away, you don't want to take time to wait to get this in dribs and traps, I urge you to visit my site, benjaminhalmberg.com, and have a couple of different options to be able to give you the manual for the brain in one shot, learn everything you need to do to manage the brain the supercomputer between your ears effectively and create the life that you desire and deserve fast. Thanks for listening and have an amazing life.